So here it comes, the all new Toyota Tacoma. This thing looks so sweet. Driveway delivery. Hey everyone, so welcome to the channel. Today we are taking delivery of the latest year model for the third generation Toyota Tacoma. This is a 2023 TRD Pro. You could say it is a little bit bright. This is solar orange or solar octane. And from what I've been able to tell, it's a very, very hard color to come across. It's also bright and in your face. So today we are going to take a quick look around this truck here and I have it for one week. I am super excited. If you're new to the channel, I own a 2017. So one of the earlier models for the third generation Tacoma. And I am super pumped to check this truck out. So let's start off with the exterior. Where as you already saw in the intro, there are so many TRD and TRD Pro emblems to let you know that this is a TRD Pro. My favorite is the one stamped on the sides of the bed. You can see those indentations. A lot of manufacturers went to these stamps in the tailgate, and this is one of the only vehicles, I think the, the Tundra TRD Pro also has that on the side, but I think that is a very cool design to see. Now, I'm going to be filming a lot of content surrounding this truck, so if you'd like to see uh, comparing this to my Tacoma to the 2024 year model, definitely stay tuned to uh, check out all of those videos. Now, as far as from my experience with my 2017 there, not a whole lot of changes. I do have a TRD off-road instead of the Pro. So the Pro here even gets the Bilstein suspension. Look at these upper control arms. That is something new that I did not know. They had almost these billet style upper control arms. The suspension is going to be about an inch and a half or so up front and half an inch uh, taller than non-TRD models. So a little bit higher than the stock suspension that was on my TRD off-road. This also gets pro underneath the headlight housings. We have a 360 camera system too, which is new to me. There's a camera up front. There's also one on the side mirrors too. The hood scoop is nothing new. I wish it was functional, but it looks awesome with TRD Pro down the side. We have the skid plate, of course, and the aggressive tires. Would be nice to see some rock sliders instead of those side steps, just because it is the TRD Pro. This has the five foot bed as well. And then to take a look at this interior, we have the leather seats, something I do not have in my truck, as well as a sunroof, which of course you would get with the top of the line trim level here. And a pretty simple interior, nothing too different from my truck. That's what I love about the Tacomas in general. Everything is laid out well and it's pretty easy to go through. Let's fire this up though, because I wanna look at this camera system since of course that is not on my truck. And what do you guys think? Is it time to upgrade from my 17. I'm going to be going over that in some other videos as well, but let's see if we can pull up the camera system. Okay, so I think we only get the top-down view. How do we go into the forward-facing camera? That is one thing. Maybe the view button over here. Let's see here. Aha! So we have the forward-facing camera there, and I think that's probably all you get with that angle. Nonetheless, that is still awesome because I do wish I had one on mine, at least for off-roading purposes, it would be nice to have. Aside from that though, everything else is pretty much the same with that rear glass there. Ooh, let's look at the headroom there. I just noticed that for your backseat passengers. The Tacoma is a smaller size truck, of course, but a lot of people do have complaints about the rear passenger 
uh, seating area. And my head, let me turn the camera around. My head is actually just up against the headliner here. I think this is different than my truck. I'll have to go back and look at my truck, but I think we have a little bit more headroom here. Maybe the 2024 will be even better. We'll have to stay tuned to see more of that. So first impressions for this 2023, I love it. I am a huge Tacoma fan. If you haven't been able to tell, I'm on my second one going for my third Tacoma here very, very shortly. But with a quick look, we even have that TRD exhaust, which sounds really good. Why don't we get this out on the road and see our first initial impressions with how this drives. All right, so we're behind the wheel now for this TRD Pro. And honestly, since I've had my own Tacoma, I have a TRD off-road that is well modified. If you wanna check out all those videos, we have a Tacoma playlist. The TRD Pro is not a truck that I really have been around a whole lot. The Pros are so hard to get because a lot of people want to get them. It's the top trim level. This is the big boy for the mid-sized Tacoma that gets all of the bells and whistles, the suspension, you get all the badging, you get a really, really capable truck. And obviously the, well, the head, the forward facing camera pops up at slow speeds here. I think you can have that automatically do that. But for the TRD Pro, let's give it an acceleration here. Sounds pretty good with that TRD exhaust. But with the Pro, it's the most expensive because you have everything, even crawl control, which my truck does have, that's available on the off-roads, but it's standard on the Pro. So if you wanna get the TRD Pro, they're pretty hard to find, I would say, uh, which is why I haven't been able to film them as much. So I get to drive this one around for one week. I am making so many videos on this, so make sure you subscribe, stay tuned for uh, plenty of uh, more Tacoma content to come to the channel. This is exciting. I am sitting much lower than in my Tacoma because this is a stock height, of course. Uh, so it's a different vibe to be in a different Tacoma. I've been driving mine the last five years, so getting to drive this around now is pretty cool. Now, just to give you guys kind of a sneak peek of what I will be filming in the next week here with this truck, I'm going to do a comparison between my Tacoma and this one because we pretty much have the first year third gen and the last year third gen to compare and see what they've done with the third gen Tacoma in general. I'm also going to be comparing this with the 2024, which should be the fourth generation for the Tacoma. I'm even more pumped for that, but Basically, if you want the Tacoma how it's set up now before they possibly go to some of the hybrid engines and some of that technology, this is gonna be the last model year to get the Tacoma the way that it sits. Now we are in the six speed automatic. You can still get for 2023 a manual transmission option, which I will talk about in some other separate videos with the next generation Tacoma. But yeah, this is going to be super exciting. And so far, the suspension in the Pro, it's driving very, very nicely. I'm not going that far right now, and I hope to maybe take this off-road. We'll see if I am able to do that or not. But so far, it's driving very nice, and I'll touch, I'll touch briefly on the uh, next suspension setup for the uh, 2024 in a separate video. But I'm super excited, you guys, taking delivery of a TRD Pro. Having two Tacomas for the week is gonna be pretty cool. Just a mild acceleration. It's interesting because there's a lot more tech in this truck than in mine. So I'm, I'm having to figure out some of the new buttons. Even though there's not that many, there is a, a good bit of a more technology available than on my truck. But yeah, this is pretty sweet. This is very comfortable. And uh, I'm, I'm a huge Tacoma fan. I'm not going to try to be biased towards the Tacoma in all of these videos. It's mainly just my personal experience since I've owned two of them. So I've had over 100,000 miles combined between both of my Tacomas. 
so I have a lot of experience with this truck. This is also the best-selling mid-size truck in 2022 alone. They sold over 150,000 more units than some of the other mid-size trucks. So this is an incredibly popular platform. Probably one of the biggest followings too for off-roading and overlanding is the Tacoma. Some of the other competitors do that, but I think Tacoma has the largest following, which is why I'm also excited for the fourth gen to come out because I hope that they keep some of the design elements and technology that Tacoma owners want in order for that to continue the trend to be one of the best selling mid-sized trucks. And I'm super excited for it. I'm, uh, I'll go over some of that in some of the other videos and content that I make. But yeah. We have the JBL audio sound system for this truck too. They start right around $46,000 or so. So it's been a little bit of an increase since I bought mine in 2017. And uh, we'll only, time will tell what the fourth gen will cost. Uh, but for a mid-sized truck, yes, it's getting expensive, but you're also getting a lot more. And I'm excited to see where Toyota takes this. We have a few tw twisties here to really test the suspension. It's driving well for the slow speeds I'm doing and we have a speed bump, so let's just see what it's like. I mean, it's a truck. That's what it is meant for. But yeah, the new Tacoma Pro. You guys, I'm so excited to drive this for the next week. I'm even more excited to hopefully be able to check out the 2024. So it's time to start filming some more content surrounding the uh, TRD Pro, the last year for the third generation Tacoma. And I hope you guys enjoy all the content that I have coming. Today was just a collection day of this truck, kind of getting my feel for the latest model for the third gen, a little bit different of course than my TRD off-road, but I'm super excited to check this truck out and really give you guys some more in-depth details with not only this truck, but also the fourth generation that is coming because I feel like I have a really good following of the Tacoma and being a Tacoma enthusiast myself, I'm gonna try to get you guys all the uh, content and information that I can surrounding the Tacoma in general. So if you have any other questions for me, comment down below and let me know what you would like to see. But yeah, the 2023 Tacoma TRD Pro in Solar Octane might be getting a lot of looks in this truck with how bright and unique this orange color is. But I hope you enjoyed today's video. Give it a huge thumbs up. Consider smashing that subscribe button so you don't miss out on all of our daily uploads as well as all of our Tacoma content that is coming or has already been posted. But well, that's gonna wrap it up for today's video. I will see you guys in the next video. Uh -huh.